NASA paying tribute to those who lost their lives pursuing space exploration today. It's the Space Agency's Day of Remembrance. They honored the crews of Apollo 1, the Space Shuttle Columbia, and the Shuttle Challenger, which exploded 73 seconds after blastoff. That happened 35 years ago today. Seven crew members died, including Krista McAuliffe, who would have been the first teacher in space. A retired teacher from Toma was a finalist in that teacher in space project. In Wisconsin, there was 304 applications. Five of us were selected to go to Madison for interviews and two of those were selected to go to Washington, D.C. in the summer of 1985. Then at Washington, D.C., there was about a week of training and uh, uh, people that we met. And then they selected 10, and then he's, they selected two. And one of those was uh, Krista McAuliffe, the other was Barbara Morgan. And they sent the rest of us home. Shekel says becoming a finalist opened a door, a lot of doors for him for travel, to deliver presentations and talk about the space program.